And you two, you two know you're in trouble. Okay, you. All right, I had to get out here to get this on camera before it got dark. Look at all the ducks. They're on top of their hut. Now they're all excited though they're coming down. Why? Because the big dogs are coming. Oh, we got kicked out of the pet lodge. No, Parker, look where the duck is. What? Oops, you're right. Yeah. I know, I see where Did you see the duck right in the top of the hut? Yep. Yeah. How do you get up there? <laughs> Big enough to jump up there, I guess, from the hay bale. <laughs> it's pretty How funny, isn't it? <laughs> All right, here we are. New Year's Eve, we finally got that snow we've been wanting. Michael works today, so I wanted to come and check out the ducks to make sure everybody's okay. Oh, I heard a little baby duck somewhere. Oh, it's hard to do with one hand. Well, there's two eggs in there. How many of you guys are in there? One, two, three, four. It's okay, guys. Camera to focus. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All accounted for. They've been going up here, and as you can see, they've been pooping lots up there. So that's a bummer. Hey guys. I know. They're gonna be so mad. Oh my gosh, there's three eggs. All right, check it out. Three eggs. I know, now you're gonna charge me. They're saying, get out. All right, so it's a little bit colder today. But all the duckies are warm. They're mad because I took their eggs. And I think they clearly need some more water. So I will do that next. Look at that. One day we have rain on Christmas and now we have snow. Coming out here. We need some water. We have almost zero degree temperatures today. Uh oh. That went okay. Um. It looks like the feathers got bit or something. Where was it? It was up there, but the that male duck was like cornering the babies. So like, look. Uh oh. It's all bloody. Oh, what the heck? You're a jerk. I don't know. What... Might have to cage you off, Black Duck Joe. Stay in there. 
Yep, yeah, you guys are in trouble. Oh, are they all back there? So that's the problem with our setup. Is yep. that the black duck is scaring them on top of the roof. Look at That one too? Yeah, so, I don't know. Gotta get a divider or something, I guess. Or separate the two. That's sad. This one, look. That one, that one looks fine. This one, no, look. Oh. There's... Yeah. All right, black duck. What do we gotta do with you? These guys are your children. <laughs> He's gonna be hard to tell, but. You're okay. Well, it looks okay. Yeah. Were they all stacked up behind the hut? Yes. Well, yeah, we gotta add a maybe like a board or something so well, they can't go back there. Let me see if I can get this hay bale back here. Like flip it on its side. Is the hut strong enough to have it? No guys, no! Yeah, they go, they end up going around, they get trapped back there, and then they really can't move. So that's kind of been our, our, our struggle, is the black duck is being mean. There's still one more. Or maybe not. I think so. It's like I liked it back there. In here. They're in there. <laughs> yes, it's true. I know you're looking at me like you don't believe me. <laughs> what, we got seven? I don't know. I have to count them. And you two. You two know you're in trouble. Okay. You. Not okay, mister. Do you understand? You have baby feathers in your mouth. No shame. No, I don't think he feels bad. Did it make it back there? Yeah. Yeah, what a jerk. Went right at him. Oh, you wrapped in your uh, string there. Stop. That was me and... <laughs> so apparently male ducks will be mean to their babies. Even though they, they don't realize that they're their babies. You got feathers in your mouth. Rude. Oh. Yeah, you tell me about it. I have to put one of those kennel cages out here. She can't behave and be nice. Well, he's pecking the feather tips right off of them. Yeah. I mean, you could put one of those big wired crates out here with a heat lamp. Get yet another heat lamp for out here, and he just has to be in there until they get bigger. I mean, I like to think they wouldn't fight to the death once they get full size. I'm wondering if their feathers are like that because they're getting stuck in the chicken wire. It could be them trying to back up and get out. Yeah. yeah. Could be. Yeah, I mean, if they're backing up and their feathers are getting caught and they're struggling. 
Are you guarding an egg there, down there, there's Mama? Three eggs over there. Where? In the hut behind the can. Oh, is there? Mm -hmm. No, I'm holding on to you. I'm you, gonna let them eat their food. Cause you're a jerk. You're a jerk. Oh wow. It's actually really toasty in here. With that heat lamp? Yeah. It's very comfy. Okay. C6. Unless there's one in that corner I can't see. I don't know, you'll have to look. I see six. Where's Furiosa? Guys, where's Curiosa? Might be in the corner, but Has to be in there. There's no way they got out. Oh, Curios is back here. <laughs> the Mohawk. One. Hey. Okay. Shh. Let's check you over. Feel cold? Mm -hmm. See? I it could be because of the chicken wire. Why their feathers are getting jacked up. I mean if yeah, they're just hiding sure back through the whole time. Let's see. They also shed their feathers. I, I read that as well too. That when they when they start getting their adult feathers, it's look at how pretty her the brown the colors are. Yeah. yeah. But when they get when they start getting their adult feathers, they start to naturally shed their old feathers. Maybe somebody that watches this video can tell us <laughs> if this is normal or if we just gotta blame our black duck on everything. And we still have the new baby inside the house. That's our last baby. Right now that one's staying in our son's room. Once it's big enough, it'll come out here and join the rest. But I have a feeling that one's going to be an inside duck for most of this winter. Since it didn't have a chance to grow up yet. Boy, they look like they're starving. I wonder how long they were stuck back there. All day, probably. I have to get something in the grub of their hay bale and put it back there so that way they can't fall back there. Yeah, that or just a board, I guess.
Yeah. Have you been seeing the mom duck chase them at all? The little duck house we got though is pretty durable. I'm surprised I can handle as much weight on it for being plastic. What time is it? Uh, it is 1.30. Okay. I feel like I should try to get the hay broken up because I still feel like they can still get stuck back there. But it's frozen, so. <laughs> Come here. Oh, look at you, Mama. You are a big girl. Hi. Hi. Oh no, be yet intact again. Oh, what a jerk. Wow. Stop it. He's trying to make... He's trying to mate with her. You think so? No, you can't go back there anymore. Yeah, I think the cage just has to come out here for the the black duck. It's just Is he this mean to you? Is he is he this mean to you? Yeah. Black one was gonna go in there after him. Yeah, it doesn't hesitate though. It goes right at him as soon as they come out. Oh, that happened. all sad and deformed and that one froze but that one's good they feel better about it it just tried to go back there again yes uh. That's thing now, if they get back there, no, they're, stuck, stuck. they're really, really stuck, yeah. Uh, <sighs> I should just put another hay bale right here. Yeah. Might as well. They're probably gonna jump up on top somehow. <laughs> Follow behind him. <laughs> well, there's just that one little crack in the middle, but hopefully that's enough to deter them. <laughs> I'll turn this one on its side because it can't seem to jump when it's like this high. For me, it's almost like it doesn't, it's not so bad that they can get up there to get away from the ducks. But 
Yeah, I don't know. Any final final words? No. <laughs> <laughs> My toes are cold. Everything you thought it'd be? I love these ducks. I just don't know why he's gotta be so mean. <sighs> Cause they gotta they all have to come out here to get the water. Yeah. And they can't digest their food without water. Yep, wire, wire, wire crate. Put the black one in it for for the day until we get a divider or something. We decided that we're gonna let the big ducks walk around in the snow because they're being such jerks to the babies. So we're gonna give the babies a break today, and we'll keep the dogs from. <laughs> You're just gonna leave it open? Yeah. Even for the babies? Oh. Okay. Duck update. Here's one of the babies in the tub. And yes, you don't see feathers and you see scabs because the drake has been relentless. Yeah, and this is the littlest one, so it's been picking on it a lot. So we're giving it a soap bath to let it get disinfected and we'll give it a night of luxury in the house, I guess, to let it kind of heal up. But for right now, Michael separated them with a fence to keep the adults it's away. It's so sad because he, he pulled all her feathers off. Yeah. It's terrible. Like this poor dog. I never thought anything like this would happen. Yeah. Ever. I didn't think that ducks were aggressive animals by any means. A rainbow. It's raining. It's raining. Yep, yeah, apparently male the ducks are jerks. Comes down, the sun's up, and more so we have some work to do on the, on the duck thing to try to make it safe for the babies. We have dog mold it. Mm -hmm. I didn't think ducks could do something mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. terrible. Mm -hmm. Our guess is that this little one just couldn't, it wasn't big enough to jump on the hay bales to get on the top of the pen. So that's why this one got picked up so, so much. Down and get more but ducks are durable. We always hear and we have experience, so for, for sure this one will be just fine. But we definitely need to do something about the, the male duck. We might even have to give it away or have him for dinner. <laughs> We, we laugh, but that's, that's none of us would take that. any pleasure in killing a duck. It'd be pretty traumatic for all of us. The rain comes down. The thing's being a jerk. The rain comes up. Yeah, he went right after Enzo. Down. Yeah. Did you see him? Yeah. Right after Enzo and Enzo, like, not Johnny, but Enzo this time. And uh, yeah, it was like, get away. Yeah, I went right after Johnny and pulled Johnny's lips and everything. And the sun comes down. No water. So, we updates we again on our duck bacon. adventures. And our <laughs> duck